Hey, we're here with a man, Cam Haynes. You guys all know who he is. We're here for lift, run, shoot. Let's go have some fun, right? Having a great day so far. Where are we going? Eugene, Oregon. Rainy day. It's 5.50 in the morning and it's just been raining the entire way from Cookville to Nashville International. Landed had 17 minutes to get from Terminal A to Terminal B. Sprinted to Terminal B. Saw the door shutting and we were not allowed on said flight. So then we were rerouted to Seattle, and now we're here. What's the plan this morning? I guess we're gonna go run a mountain. That's what Cam does, so we're just gonna do what Cam does today. What's up? Hey, what's up, buddy? How you doing, man? How you doing? Good to meet you. Good Rich. To see ya. Yeah, you too, man. Uh, this is just a good run I like to do because I can get two summits and good yeah. miles in. Yeah. Yeah, so it's kind of my go-to. Just gonna try not to die. Yeah, we're we're taking this trail right to, right to Spencer's. Oh yeah, then we'll go here, kind of to here, then hit this thing. Side of the hill here. There's a good trail here that definitely works the quads because my whole thing is endurance. Yeah. You know, like for hunting, I'm yeah. like, it's just that grind. Right. You know, so. Just being able to kind of embrace a little suffering, pushing. This is, uh, this will definitely wake your quads up right here. Yeah. We're heading down here and we're kind of going this way. But uh, I think Baldy's right there. So you guys are going to Baldy Peak? Yeah, see that there's a trail, the road goes right by Baldy. I just said we're here. We're yeah. here to do what Cam does. It just may be much slower, but we'll do it. So we just kind of cut through here. Cool. And then that's the last little climb we got. You tell me, boss, we're with you. <laughs> You're doing great. We're good. How far have we traveled? 13.1 miles. A lot of elevation, a lot of up and down. It's the coming down that hurts. That is slick. That mud made it slick today. How many calories do you have to <laughs> All of them. All of the calories. I'm gonna roll this thing for 20 more miles. <laughs> the hard part's done. Hopefully. <clears throat> no, now I get to look like a jackass <laughs> shooting. what the house is gonna look like. If I have my way, Hillary will not like it. We tie this in and once we get you tuned up and it's shooting perfect holes, and then we've got a little bit different method of tying the peep okay. in. So like if you hit it and you yeah. bump it, it's not gonna move. Oh, yeah, Cause you've just that. got a single 
single wrap here. Yep. Like you, I could easy just slide that up and down the string. So like, let's say yeah, it let's fell and you went like that. Well, then it's we not in the right lot. spot. Yep. We're spoiled by having such yeah. a good pro shop here. Thank you. We'll see how we fly through paper here. I'll flip in on this side again. Got to shoot through papers. One way to good way up. to make sure that everything's going straight because an arrow obviously will kill from penetration and cutting the whole way. Mm -hmm. But if it hits like this, it's just not going to penetrate. Right. If it goes straight, then yeah. Gotcha. We want pass throughs, Thanks. two holes bleeding. Gotcha. And okay. your arrow blew through, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and it was a hole? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Worked on your bull. That's what we want. It's right there and then heel into it. Good. So your pressure point is right here. So that arm bone comes directly into the pressure point right there. Should feel good there yeah, too. Yeah, it feels good. Yeah, Ooh. sweet. That's a lot better. Yeah. Nice. So when you're shooting a bow, you want to just be the aimer. So you're the aimer. So you come around with all four fingers, okay. squeeze, you come down and touch, and then you go into that slow squeeze to where when it goes off, it's yes. a subconscious motion. Okay. And you're going to pressure it, you're going to pressure right into that. And it, what it does is it'll take that bow and straighten that straighten bow up, up every time. Getting better? It feels better. Like at 20, it's not going to make any difference. But if you were in the mountains yes. and if there was a hill at, a at distance, you'd be Way like up. a foot off. Yeah. So if you level. can kind of get into that that routine of just checking that level, okay. you're you're doing the same thing, but it's just a little bit to the right. the bubbles to the right. Right. And see that process that you just did right there. That's that was perfection. You know, every just bit every of time feet, do it the same. Hand, yeah. Everything right down was just perfect, and then that was your last arrow. Doing great, yeah. It's a good shot. Just um, everybody can benefit from a little coaching from Wayne. He, I call him the herd bull. He's been a beast for a long time, and he says he's getting old, but he's still the herd bull. This is what I live for. I love sharing the lifestyle. So everything I do, the running, the lifting, it's only for one reason. It's just for bow hunting, and uh, so sharing like the process I do to get ready for the mountains is one of my favorite things, especially with a great athlete like Rich. It's just been a, a dream come true for me. It's been a fun day. Go shoot some more. Watch Cam shoot to 100 yards. more fun. Oh, right beside I it. I see it. <laughs> right uh. beside it. Oh. Right below it. Dang it. <laughs> oh, right between them. Right in between them. Pop both with one shot. Oh. Get there. Got it. <laughs> Perfect. I mean, good height is a little left. Be the arrow. <clears throat> Deep breath, relax. Booyah. Good. Gotcha! Woo! Finally! Yes. Nice job. That was a good one. Freaking 85 yards, Rich Brony. Nice shooting. Take it. Appreciate it. That's a PR. That was PR. Big PR. Nice work. Big PR. Loved it. That's awesome. So we're setting all sorts of PRs. Except we still had we got a pump sesh, right? A few more miles. A few more miles. <laughs> Deer or elk? That is, um, that's Oregon elk. Oregon elk. Yeah. yeah. Sweet. Yours is good, but you've got less experience. I'm way less experience. You've got probably what, four, 40 years of experience on it? Yeah.
Nice. 10 sets of 10, of a push, do 10 sets of 10 of a pull. This is actually called German volume training. Really? Yeah. Not CrossFit. Though. This is not CrossFit. Don't okay. Work. Okay. When they coming, these legs ain't running. I'ma keep it 100. Never been a crash dummy. All I do is get money. Maybe we can slow down. I need to stop, but I keep it calm. Don't like to talk, so leave me alone. Thank you. That was great. I love spending and learning from Rich, the fittest man in the world, and we got to shoot bows and do what I do. And man, it, it was, was an honor. It was thank incredible. You're an thank animal you. on the, the trails, and then man shooting was a ton of fun. So, and hey, we got to lift. We got to do what I like to do. 85 yards, you popped that balloon. It took me a couple tries, but. <laughs> no, no, one shot. One shot. <laughs> Maybe look Keep down. hammering. That's yeah. all you need to know. <laughs> we ran a lot today and I have not been running lately so that was very hard. A lot of hills, um, a lot of fun but a lot of hills it says 2500 or 2351 calories. Average heart rate for three hours was 134. <laughs> Zone two for four hours, sorry. Max 194. So uh, day strain for the day 20.5. Is that a record for you? Uh, I think 20.7 is a record. Mm. Try to catch up on rehydration. Look, even they have a fan in here. It's more than most. Ah! 20 shoulder press, 20 sit ups. I don't really feel like we need to do weighted sit ups too. Um, while one person's doing their full seven rounds, one person's gonna ride the bike, <laughs> and vice versa. Podcast time. <laughs> All right, that's it. Podcast is now live. It'll be in the link in the description of the video. Go check it out. Make sure you comment on there. I uh, hope you guys had some fun.